Embrace the new you with Embrace Pangea. Greetings, everyone. My name is TC Atkinson, and yes, I am the founder of Embrace Pangea. And over the last four years, we have been able to help over 4,500 individuals like you to live a healthier life without breaking the bank. And today, I have one of our clients, one of our awesome, awesome, awesome individuals that have helped to make Embrace Pangea become the number one holistic company online. Um, she's just here to just share with you her experience, her story, and just, you know, how she came into using holistic health tools. So hopefully it can help you all. So we're going to let her introduce herself, just say her name and where she's located, and then we're gonna get right on into it. So let us know, what is your name? My name is Shannon, and I'm located in New York State. Hi, everyone. All right. So just so you all know, my king is actually from um, New York. So I have a good, um, I guess, good history with New York, the Big Apple. So how did you even hear about Embrace Pangea? Like, how did we even come into your sphere? Um, I was trying to go through a detox. Uh, with uh, my yoni area. <laughs> um, right. So I haven't been like sexually active for almost a year, um, but I just felt I needed something more. So okay. um, I kind of just Googled <laughs> and yours was like the top search. So, um, cause I try to look for the most um, reviews, more effective, you know, um, research and yours was like the most uh, genuine one I could find. <laughs> Oh, wow. Thank you. Like, that's something that I'm really working on here. That's why I am like, you know, interviewing you guys, because I really do want to connect with you all. Like, there are so many individuals like that we see and, you know, that use our products. But at the end of the day, like, I don't really get a chance to connect with everyone one on one, which is why I'm like, hey, I really do want to know who are you? You know, what is your story? Like, how did we even, you know, become influential in your life because we're just here doing things that we needed for ourselves and then we shared it with you guys. So that's awesome. Okay. So you found us literally online because a lot of our clients, they either get referred by their friends or they get referred by their family. Um, but, oh, okay, that's great. So you found us online and you saw our reviews and you're like, okay, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do my cleanse with Embrace Me and Gia. So you did our Yoni cleanse, um, the pearls, did you? Yeah, and I brought um, the Yoni steam. Um, so oh, yeah, both of those. Okay, so two of our things. Okay, awesome. So tell us, um, you don't have to do any like graphic details or anything like that, but why did you decide to get both the steam and the pearls? Um, well, I also went on YouTube um, and I saw a few, a few reviews, like even with Yoni eggs. Um, but just like reading about it, I was just like, you know, let me try both and see. Um, I mean, I like the steam, but I just felt like it, it's not so, um, like I, I just really want to go to just a thorough cleanse overall. Right. So, um, I, I was like, you know, let me try the pearls because that seemed to be more of show more action, I guess, more um, results. <laughs> so mm -hmm. uh, even though I did do the steam and it worked great, uh, mm -hmm. I just felt like the pearls really worked. <laughs> Okay, and that's the thing, like that's a good uh, distinction because yes, both of those detoxes that we do offer, they do cleanse the yoni, like they're focused on the yoni, the womb, the vagina, all those areas. However, they do work differently. So for instance, our pearls. Our pearls more work from like a pulling aspect. All the herbs work from a pulling aspect. So it's kind of like um, if I were to compare it to, let's say, if you're washing your face, right? So our feminine wash would be the face wash, right? It's equivalent to that. And then the pearls will be more like an astringent. So like after you do your wash, then you do like the astringent and that pulls, right? Um, whereas the steam, that's more like a facial, like, you know, if you were to steam your face. So it opens up your pores, and that's how the toxins come out. Whereas with the pearls, the pearls mainly pull them out, which is why you will definitely see that huge difference between the pearls and the steam. 
So how did you go about um, using the pearls and the steams? Because I know some of our clients, they want to know, well, can they use it after they use the pearls or use the steam after they use the pearls? Or should they use our 11 herb yoni steam before they do the pearls? So how did you do it? Um, well, I got the steam first, so I figured I'll do it first. Um, and then I did the pearls, but then after I did the pearls, I still steamed after just because I wanted to like really keep flushing it out. Um, so I, I felt like it was both needed before and after because I heard like over steaming is just like you don't want to over steam. So I right. just felt like, you know, in a month's period, just do like two or three steams. And then, um, of course, the three days of the pearls I did. Uh, I, I, I was afraid to put all three in at the same time but you know further research was like you know that it was fine but i did one day um for 24 hours and then i waited about two days because you know the stuff started coming out and then i did another one waited two days and then did the third one and yeah i, I just got results every time <laughs> and i feel so much better now <laughs> Okay, so just so everyone's on the same page when um, you all are watching this on the replay, so she didn't have like any specific um, imbalance that she was trying to, you know, correct. Like she just wanted to have like a regular cleanse, like just to be cleansing. And so she did both of our steams as well as our pearls. And um, the way she went about doing our pearls is that she did one pearl for 24 hours, took it out, waited like two days or so, and then inserted another one. And I know I tell you guys, you really do have control over how you do your cleanses, how you use our pearls, because it's not gonna be a one size fits all for everyone. Like for instance, myself, I have always done three pearls for three days, and that's how I've always done my cleanse since 2015. I've always done my cleanse that way. Um, however, I know lots of our other clients, like Shannon, who only do one pearl inserted at a time, and they have fantastic results. So that's why I'm saying to you guys, you know, when you all ask me, well, TC, TC, like how many pearls should I use? I'm just like, well, this, this is what I've personally done. And then I tell you what other clients have personally done. And you're hearing for yourself what one of our clients, Shannon, has done. So I just want you all to know that you have options. Like we have so many herbs, so many different cleanses here that you have options. If you want to do, let's say, a deeper cleanse um, that Shannon mentioned, you can do the pearls. If you want to do a lighter cleanse, then you can definitely do the steam. So we have options, you know, we have different, different options. So, um, so when, okay, when you were going through your releasing stage, right, what did you see come out? Like, how did it look to you? Because a lot of our clients, they want to know um, what's going to happen when I take them out. It's going to be something crazy. It's going to be wild. I saw the pictures, um, but from your own mouth, because it's one thing for me to say it, because, you know, it's my company. Um, and yes, I have used the pearls for years. Like at this point, it's been three years going on four. Um, but at the end of the day, it's still my company. So people may not listen to what I'm saying. So what, what would you describe it as? Well, just to say next time I'm putting all three in because <laughs> like I, I, I was, like I said, I was afraid at first, but I'm like, oh my gosh, next time I get her, I'm putting all three in because like, yeah, it's results and yeah, it's the best. So, um, <laughs> it was like, like, I can't really describe it. It was like, um, was it clear? Was it white? Was it like, like papery? Lincoln kind of like tissue paper. Yeah. Um, and yeah, it just like, it came out in like chunks and I'm sitting here like, is this bad? Like, is was something wrong with me that I didn't know? But, you know, I just researched like, you know, stuff could really just be really far up there, you know, which is why, you know, they say to really push it far up there as far as you can. Um, so, yeah, it, it, it was just crazy. But at first when it started coming out, I was honestly expecting the worst because I've seen a few reviews on YouTube yeah. and like, I've seen green stuff come out, brown stuff. I was like scared. But um, I guess it was a good sign <laughs> that it didn't come out like that. But um, yeah, I, I actually went to the doctors, um, just, you know, a regular checkup, you know, just to make sure I was, I didn't have like a yeast infection or things right. like that. And um, 
everything came out great. So I guess whatever was up there is out. <laughs> but um, yeah, so the results were great. So it's no negative side effects from it. I can say that because obviously they would have told me, you know, if they would have saw something wrong. So yeah, no negative um, feedback I got from an actual prof uh, professional. So, <laughs> And that's the thing, like, I tell you guys, listen, I am a tropical biologist in training. I'm in my PhD program. I do experiments on plants. I study the chemistry within plants. That's who I am. I'm not a doctor. I'm not a nurse. I'm not any type of medical professional. I am a researcher. That's, and I don't claim to be anything else. And so that's why I make it a point to let y'all know on our website, on the back of our packaging, hey, if you're going to do our cleanse, if you're going to do our detox, you need to go and go check with your medical professional um, just to make sure that, hey, if you're trying to detox for a specific purpose, that it is that exact purpose you're trying to detox for. And also, just like Shannon said, she went to her medical provider after she did her cleanse just to make sure. And she was fine. Everything was good. The medical professional said, hey, you know, you're fine. Um, so at the end of the day, that's just something that I understand because I do live um, between the two worlds, right? I live between the two worlds of Western medicine and like, you know, allopathic or like natural holistic medicine, right? Those are the two worlds that I live in. So I understand using herbs, but I also understand using the technology that Western medicine has so that you can actually see, hey, this is what my issue is and this is what I need to do. If you decide to use um, herbal methods or natural methods to resolve your situation, then you know exactly what it is you're doing. You're not going to be out here guessing or thinking or using um, when people look up on Google and then Google tells you you have all these different symptoms, you have all these different diseases. No, go to your medical professional. See if what you have is what you think you have. And then if you decide that, okay, holistic path is for you, then go ahead and pursue that. Um, because I'm a strong proponent of holistic remedies and um, solutions in that lane. But I'm also the same person that is going to go for my yearly exams, for my regular uh, general checkups, just to make sure that, hey, okay, I feel good, but I'm not really feeling good because people drop dead every day people have heart attacks every day so you have to make sure you're taking care of your body on a holistic platform and know where you're starting from find out what your foundation is um and then even after you do uh, a cleanse like shannon did she went and she just wanted to verify and everything was great um one other thing i wanted to just talk about in regards to what you said um, you said that you didn't realize that all those things were going to come out after you did um, our cleanse with the pearls. And that's something that happens a lot. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> because of the here here now. <laughs> oh, well, welcome. Welcome. We're here together. We're here together. Um, a lot of people don't understand that the woman's uh, womb is the sixth elimination organ. You know, people only think that, oh, we only have our colon, our sweat glands, our lungs, um, our kidneys and our livers. But as women, we have an extra elimination organ, which is our womb. And if you're, you know, you're just eating like processed foods, eating fast foods because of your lifestyle, your work schedule, or your family life, then you have to understand that when your body gets ready to eliminate, it's going to push all of those toxins into your elimination organs. And sometimes your elimination organs may not be working as well as it should be. Um, and then you're going to get things backed up. So for instance, your colon, right? Your colon, you're supposed to be eliminating one to three times a day from your colon. And a lot of people are not doing that. So what that means is we're eating three to five meals a day, we're snacking, we're not drinking enough water, and guess what, we're not eliminating the toxins if we're taking in all those meals, so now we're backed up. So when someone does, let's say, a colon cleanse with our clean cold, they're like, oh my gosh, I didn't know all this stuff was in me. Well, you're not eliminating properly 
plates and you're eating all the time. So of course, and that's the same thing with um, when you do like a yoni cleanse using like our Pangea pearls, then yes, you are going to see the toxins, that bacteria, the yeast, the dead cells, dead skin cells that are going to come out that may not have had a chance previously to be eliminated. So I'm really glad that you touched on that because you're just like, oh, I didn't know. <laughs> so yes, um, but let me see. What, um, why would you recommend someone to do a yoni cleanse with our pearls? Um, I'm really glad that you actually contacted me. It's so funny because I was actually gonna make a video on Facebook about this subject like it's just really weird how this connection just happened like <laughs> well you know but, how the universe works seriously like i i was literally like because i feel like if it works for me i should put the word out you know i don't want to like give people information off of guessing like i've had this experience and if it worked for me i'm gonna give you what the information that worked for me it may not work for you but i'm just gonna be honest on my behalf you know, because, you know, I want all of us to heal, you know, because um, I, I have four children and like, I just felt like after four kids, like I needed to heal. I needed to just repair my whole womb, <laughs> you know, like, like I said, like I was trying to be on like the sex pass or sexual right. course. Right. And I'm like, it has to be more than this, you know, saging spiritual baths. I'm like, I, I didn't feel like I was getting the whole job done. Um, so, you know, I just feel like, you know, I, each one teach one. You know, I'm glad that I found out about this because, like I said, results. <laughs> so um, I'm still going to do the video, though. Um, oh, probably hey. tomorrow. You're welcome. Um, just probably tomorrow because I actually have to go to work in about an hour and a half. So um, or maybe even later tonight. I don't know. Um but just so that, you know, we can heal our sisters and um, build, you know, because it's not just a physical thing. It's a spiritual right. thing, emotional. Um, and, and that, too, you know, just that the soul ties, you know, throughout the years. Um, I just felt like I just had to heal that way, too. So um, and it's I, I feel like released more uh, and I've been attracting more um, loving energy. Um so yeah, just overall, it was just really great. Thank you. <laughs> and that you touched on a really good topic. Um, I did a video years ago, um, just talking about the differences between like the womb, yoni, and vagina. And a lot of people, like you said, like they don't really know that. Yes, when you do have um, multiple partners, you do have a piece of them left inside of you because their DNA is left that's just how the vagina is it holds on to things you know it's a vessel like yes you have life force coming out and going in so when you have your partner going inside of you that's life force going in when you have let's say the passage or you said you have four children that's life force going out and also you have the karma free shedding of blood that happens on a regular like a monthly session when we do have our cycles so there's a lot of traffic that is going through our vaginas and you do have to give it some time you give it a break give it a rest you do have to cleanse it detox it you know it's just like in anything like if we're driving on the street you know Every so often, the city workers, they come and they do what? They repave the street. They upkeep the street. Why? Because there's so much traffic. And a lot of times, we're not really looking at it from that perspective. Um, or even if you have your car, after driving your car every so often, you have to go get an oil change. You have to go get a checkup. You have to go and fix your tires because that's just all part of maintenance. So when it comes to us as women, and even men in general, just when it comes to people, we have to build in detoxification routines within our lifestyle because we're just like wearing our bodies, wearing our bodies, wearing our bodies, and we're not really like upkeeping them, maintaining them, like fortifying them so that we can have them for another 10, 20, 30 years without feeling like aches and pains and all these other things. So I'm really happy that you touched on that. Like, yes. Yes, soul ties, energy ties, like you have to be very conscious of that. I'm so glad that you were able to touch on that. Um, but let me see, what else, what else, what else? 
Um, so you, you had an aha moment. You had um, your uh, moment where you're just like, oh no, this, this works for me then. It needs to work for everybody else. Everyone else needs to know about this. Um, but other than that, um, any last words? Because, oh, here's one thing. We didn't really talk much about this, our 11 Herb Yoni Steam. So you receive 12 packets because each one comes with 12. So I recommend like using three to four packets per steam, but how many did you use? Um, I used four because I okay. was trying to do three steams in a month. Okay. So I used four like before I did the pearls and then um, four, four, four after the pearls and then um, – I about waited a week and ended the other ones that way it was all okay. in a month um so yeah it's past due time now for me to like do another one this month but I'm still gonna try to keep up as much as possible because like I said I, I see results which is why I want to do the video and just um I just recently got into a relationship too and I was explaining to him you know how I wanted to cleanse myself because you know speaking of soul ties it can affect him right. and I wanted to make sure I was clean before affecting him because you know if you really love somebody you're gonna make sure that they're good so you know I don't want to pass on that to them and then <laughs> this whole cycle well so. that is amazing <laughs> like that is that just speaks to you as a woman like how aware you are because some women are not aware and they don't really take that responsibility to ensure like the the prosperity of their next relationship so kudos thank you like yes well, yes yes <laughs> like, no but seriously like that leads to strong families you know strong solid families like and that just speaks to like, you've taken responsibility and just encouraging other women to take responsibility because what you just said may have encouraged someone else to say you know what Yes, I do need to play an active role in ensuring the prosperity of my next relationship, you know. So, thank you. Like, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, but is there anything else that you would like to say um, before we close out? Um, let me see. Is there anything else you'd like to say? Um, I know I'm probably going to think about something after this, but um, I'll just add it into my video that I'll make on Facebook. and you know, um, passing on a message to other people so that they can, you know, get the same cleanse because, yeah, this is a necessity, right? This is just very important. So, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you. So there you have it, everyone. Um, you heard directly from Shannon coming out of New York State. Um, she definitely, she got our pearls and she also got our 11 herb yoni steams. And, um, you heard from her own mouth, like what she had to say, what her experiences was and what she recommended for you guys. Um, so that way you all can live a healthier life without breaking the bank by using our natural hygiene products and herbal detoxes that we offer here at EmbracePNGA.com. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below or go to our website, EmbracePNGA.com. Click the menu section, go to contact us, and drop us a line. And we'll be sure to get right back to you. But with all that being said, shout out to all the gods, goddesses, kings, queens, and especially those that are living. Shout out to you guys because you all are doing the work necessary to live a healthier life, to achieve your personal health and wellness goals. And we are here to support you the best way that we can. And with that, I leave you in nothing less than peace, love, and wellness. Bye! I really hope you enjoyed this installment. Please remember to share, like, follow, subscribe, and comment. If you would like to receive any of the items discussed in this video, just jet on over to our site, EmbracePangea.com. There you will find our complete selection of natural hygiene products and herbal detoxes. If you would like me to speak at your next event, simply submit your request by going to our site, EmbracePangea.com. From our menu selection, click contact us and then select event speaking request. If you're ready to dive deeper into cleansing and detoxing your body, then I look forward to seeing you at our upcoming detox retreat. For more details about the retreat, just go over to our site, embracepangea.com. From our menu section, click detox retreats and enter your best contact information so I can send all the good details over for our upcoming retreat. 
If you would like to earn a living healing your community, then join the Embrace Pangea family and become either a distributor or affiliate. For more details about these programs, just go to our site, embracepangea.com. From our menu section, click Income Opportunities. With that being said, I'll leave you nothing less than peace, love, and wellness. Embrace the new you with Embrace Pangea.